Hey guys, so the iPhone's camera is one of the most used in the world, and it needs some more features, and Apple's not really adding any lately. So here are 8 Cydia jailbreaks that should make it a little bit better. First up is Cambler 7 and Transparent Camera Bar. Now for me, it sometimes works, sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes I don't see the blur, and it's supposed to blur out those annoying black bars, and I always hated them. I wish that there was something that could overlay over it, and... I like that this jailbreak uh, hides the black bars and makes it transparent, but for some reason just for me, sometimes it doesn't work. Next up is Tap Tap Flip, and it's pretty self-explanatory, just double tap on the screen and it'll change which camera it's pointing at. And just in case you wanted to take a midnight selfie but it's too dark, use Front Flash, which takes the idea from the iPhone 6s and gives it to all older devices. Next up is Front Cam on Mirror, and it basically just unmirrors your selfie. For some reason, for me, it crashes. I'm not sure about anyone else again. This is Enable Live Photos, and this takes the iPhone 6s's live photos and adds it to older devices. All you have to do is just make sure that you're tapping more on the screen. Don't try and use pressure because you will damage your screen if you do. And next up is Effects Plus. And what this does is it gives you more effects that you can work with. So there's thermal, there's blur, there's just a bunch that you can choose from as you can see. And I don't find this useful, but I'm pretty sure a lot of Instagram and Snapchat goers will like these filters. Next up is activator, and activator has a lot of like gestures and buttons that you can do to open certain apps or do certain things. So I like to use touch ID as a way to open my camera if I see something, you know, take a quick photo, kind of like on the Galaxy phones. And next up is Record and Torch, and it's pretty self-explanatory. As we know, when you try and record and you forget to turn on the light, then you have to stop recording. So with this, you can just continue recording and turn on the lights or turn it off if you don't need it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.